Hey guys, Peter here, and I know you've already read the title, so let's just start the video. Control C to copy. Control X to cut. Control V to paste. Control L or Alt D to highlight the address bar. Control Tab to quickly switch between tabs. Or use Control and the 1 to 8 number keys to switch between the first 8 tabs in that order. Search A to open Google Assistant. Control T for a new tab. Control N for a new window. Control E to highlight the address bar but in Google Search instead of URL mode. Control R to reload a page. Alt Tab to quickly switch between windows. Control Window Switch Key for a full screen screenshot. Or Control Shift Window Switch Key for a partial screenshot. Alt search to disable or enable caps lock. Search plus open or close square bracket to switch between virtual desks. Control W to close the current tab. Control Shift W to close the current window. Shift search plus sign to create a new virtual desk. Alt plus open or close square bracket to snap a window to one side of the screen. Alt plus to maximize a window or use Alt minus to minimize a window. Shift, search, open or close square bracket to move windows between virtual desktops. Control Alt T to open Crosh, the built-in terminal for Chrome OS. Control Shift N for a new incognito window. If you drag a link into the tab bar, it will open a new tab. Or use Control click to open a link in a new tab and shift click to open in a new window, shift search minus to delete the current virtual desktop. Note that this won't close any windows, they'll just be moved to the next available desktop. Control shift T to reopen a tab or window you just closed. Control alt shift reload to rotate a window. Bet you didn't see that one coming. If you have a term in the address bar, press control and enter to add www and .com to the term and then load the site. Alt-Shift-B to highlight the bookmarks bar. Alt-Arrow keys to go backwards and forwards through web pages. Control-J to open the downloads page. Control-H to open your history. Control-P to print a page. Control-R to reload a page. Control and plus or minus to zoom in or out and Control-0 to reset zoom. Control shift d saves all current open tabs in the current window into a new bookmarks folder. Control d bookmarks just your current page. Control f to search for words within a website. Alt e to show the chrome menu. Control shift o to show the bookmarks manager. Control shift j, c, or i each open up different developer panels. I have no clue what they do, but they could make you look like a hacker, I guess, who knows. Control shift b to show or hide the bookmarks bar. Control u to show page source, which is um, a thing you can see, I guess. Search escape to show the task manager. Alt and the 1 to 8 keys click your taskbar icons in that order. Control period will show hidden files within the files app. This is mostly useful for browsing Linux files. Control shift plus or minus will adjust display zoom. Control slash opens the help center, which is now the explore app. Alt shift M opens files. Alt shift S opens the quick settings area. Shift search instantly opens the full screen launcher instead of clicking or swiping multiple times. When a file is selected in files, click space to preview it, similar to macOS. Control shift reload will rotate your display 90 degrees. Alt shift N shows your notifications. Alt shift I opens the feedback window. While holding search, the keys at the top of the keyboard will work as though they are regular function keys. Search backspace to delete forward instead of backwards. Control backspace to delete the previous word. Control search back arrow and forward arrow to go to the start or end of a document. And use search forward or back arrow to go to the start or end of a line. Control back or forward arrow to go to the start or end of a word. Control shift V to paste without formatting. 
Control Z to undo, or Control Shift Z to redo. Control A to select everything. Control Shift and arrow keys to select the previous or remaining part of a word compared to where your cursor is. Shift, search, arrow keys to select text to the beginning or end of a line from where your cursor is. And finally, Control Alt Slash to see all keyboard shortcuts. Wow, that was a lot of shortcuts. I would now like to mention a few other things, so please don't leave yet. Today is a sad day for the channel, as this may be my last Chromebook video for a while. It's unfortunate, but I will still be doing my best to bring you awesome content now and in the future. A quick roadmap of what's happening in the upcoming weeks. I'm gonna have a MacBook Pro review, an awesome mouse review, an AirPods comparison review, and possibly some laptop hardware upgrades. Stick around if you don't want to miss any of that. This video took a lot of time and effort to make, so if you enjoy, I'd really appreciate it if you hit like and subscribe. The channel is rapidly approaching a thousand subscribers, and you can help us reach that milestone. On that note, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.